what would you say is that like what level of competitiveness is it like do most students have you know over 10,000 hours of research mm. or have they done fellowships or you know research intensive programs in the past like what are you seeing in terms of who is getting accepted for MD PhD programs I wish there were like a uniform answer that I could use because then that would make it a lot easier I think it really is a confluence of multiple factors where you come from unfortunately you in terms of like the school that you come from does play a little bit of part, right? Like I came from a small liberal arts college in Chicago. And so the research opportunities I had were very different than say my friends who went to NYU. What really I think sets apart the students that I see, at least in my cohort, is the richness of experience, right? I did two research fellowships and I worked for about a year and a half at an emergency room as a medical scribe. So these individuals are doing road scholar programs. These are individuals who were in consulting for a couple of years. And these are all individuals who are in my cohort of MD PhDs. Friends who did two years in Tanzania. There's not one size fits all. It's about what you do with the opportunities you have. Maybe there is an all encompassing answer is that there is grit among all these individuals. You're going to get dropped more times than you're going to get lifted. Having the energy mm -hmm. and the clear mindset to lift yourself up when no one is holding the handout to help you is incredibly important, I think, for success in this field. 